Hey everyone, it's Haley. Happy Bookmas Day 3. Today we are going to be getting extra festive because we are going to be decorating my bookshelves for Christmas. I love Christmas, which apparently surprises people in real life because I'm more of a Grinch in reality, like 100%, but that doesn't mean that I can't love Christmas. I bought so many decorations this year. I had to take out a loan. I didn't actually, but I bought a lot. So I've got a box here, I've got a bag here, and I'm going to make these shelves look like an elf shat on them. That was a charming way of saying, I'm going to decorate my shelves. Let's put on the Christmas tunes. I can't think of a Christmas tune right now, so this is my Christmas song. Bookmark it, cause it's a bookmark Christmas song. Books are good gifts for you. If you just exited this video, I am not surprised and I respect your very correct decision. No copyright! Christmas decorations on the way but I wanted to give you a tour of what I have so far. I have something that I ordered the other day so that won't be in for a little bit but I'm super happy with my shelf. Oh wait I need to light up my Christmas tree. Ta-da! I also have some stuff that I'm gonna pull out later tonight and then I'll put it in my room but this is it for now and I think it looks so cute so I'm gonna show you. So first of all I have my lights lit up all green and red which is awesome. It just makes me so happy. And then I have my little North Pole red road sign which is so cute that is from Michaels and then over here we have this little candy cane Christmas tree with a little silver star on top that is from Home Sense and then coming over here we've got another thing from Home Sense most of this actually all of this is from Home Sense and Michaels so I'll just stop saying but this is a cute little reindeer I love her she is so cute look at her long little legs and she's got like sort of skate things on and she just sits there and she's like hey girl hey I love her and then coming down here we have our Christmas countdown. This is actually incorrect. It's 22 days until Christmas question mark. I'm pre-filming this so I don't know. I'm gonna say 22. No, 20, 21. 21 question mark? I'll figure it out or you will all tell me. But that is in a little reindeer. I'm gonna have to figure it out for the rest of my pre-filming. Next coming over here we have this really cute wooden star that I'm actually probably gonna keep on my shelf year round because I think it looks really nice and it's not really like super Christmassy. I just think it's cute. And now coming over here we have this nutcracker who is glittery and gold and happy to be here folks. Yeah that was bad ventriloquism but obviously I had to have at least one nutcracker on my shelves and he's got a little house. He's got a little gingerbread house which is super sparkly and very cute. Look at them. Adorable. Then coming down here we've got this really really cute arctic fox. I love him. I think he is so adorable and he just sits there on top of the blue books like he's in the tundra or something. And then over here we have the Christmas tree. This is a neon green Christmas tree. It is so bright and so fun and it just makes me very very happy. I'm kind of debating switching it out with where gingerbread stuff is but I'm just gonna keep it there for now. Next we have this little very Canadian lantern because it's got a moose on it and I don't have batteries for it but it does light up so I'll get some batteries and then it will be all lit up and beautiful. Next we have another animal and that is a polar bear with his little pretty knit scarf. He is so cute. 
I need names for all of these animals because they are adorable. And then we come to my favorite thing of all. We have my little Christmas sweater wiener dog. For those of you who don't know, dachshunds are my favorite dogs in the entire world and I want one very badly and I've always wanted one and I know that there are a lot of work. Don't worry, I wouldn't get one if I couldn't commit to it. But when I move out, I'm gonna get me a little wiener dog. So for now, this is gonna have to do. Look at how cute he is. I love him so much. He is from Pier One and he was expensive, but he was worth the investment. And then coming over here, we have another Christmas tree. This one has just like a really pretty wintry scene on it. I thought it was just very nice. And then over here we have a squirrel because I love squirrels. I don't know if you guys know that. I have a squirrel that I feed. His name is Andrew and he's actually a black squirrel because that's what we have where I live. But this is a little brown squirrel. He's got his little pine cone, his little scarf, and he's all ready for winter. So I didn't put anything on my bottom shelves because obviously you aren't going to see that. But I think that the top part looks beautiful. I'm super happy with how it turned out. So that is going to be all for Bookmas Day 3 where we decorated for Bookmas. We are now all ready for the rest of the season for the next 22 days. Yeah, it should be 22, right? I don't know. I can't count right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you liked decorating with me. If you wanted to stay caught up with Bookmas, then don't forget to click that subscribe button and then click that bell icon so you'll be notified whenever I post. I'll be putting up a new video every day up until Christmas. You can also follow me on all of my social media, all my handles, links, all that fun stuff will be down below for you guys. So thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!